Hello and welcome to MTV News on day 4 of 2018. Congratulations, you've made it this far. Only 361 days to go. Charlotte Crosby has just released her new workout book, 30 Day Blitz. For those of you who haven't already fallen off the New Year's resolution bandwagon, though if you have, same, don't be hard on yourself. You're still amazing and honestly, it's fine. But if you do want to kickstart a new routine, here's Charlotte with her advice. So this is my new book, 30 Day Blitz, and it is a Bible on what to be eaten in your diet. It also has exercises, it also has tips, but the thing that I know everyone is going to want to know is the diet plan, which is a 30 day diet plan telling you exactly what to eat and when to eat it. Three things that people should know before starting it is that you never have to be scared because the whole way through I'm giving advice on what to do if you fall off the bandwagon, what to do if you don't go to the gym that often, like I'm going to be helping you every single step of the way so there's nothing to be scared about. Number two is you need to get the shopping list dead on because there's a lot of ingredients in most of the meals that are a little bit complex and a little bit more exotic so make sure you've got the shopping list like to the book so you can make all the recipes perfect and the third thing would be get ready to see some good photographs of me dogs <laughs> Louis Tomlinson has slammed the Coachella lineup for not having any bands in it, which is funny because he left a band to go solo, but anyway. Louis tweeted, just seen the Coachella lineup. Where the f are all the bands? It's a festival. Fans were quick to point out on Twitter that, well, they're probably on hiatus. And Louis, it's a bit unfair. There are bands. There's, um, Time, there's War on Drugs, there's Ulce, there's... Yeah, okay, there aren't a huge amount of bands, but that probably reflects the fact that Coachella is largely a major American pop music festival rather than an indie one in the south of England headlined by, like, the kooks. And so the lack of bands probably reflects the fact that these days the pop music charts are predominantly solo artists. And in lots of cases, ones who are once upon a time in a band, from Beyonce to Camille Cabello to, well, yourself. Is Courtney act to appear in Celebrity Big Brother? Maybe, it's not confirmed, but we really hope it is because a RuPaul's Drag Race Celebrity Big Brother crossover is exactly the kind of good news we need to get us through a really bleak January winter and there's not even Christmas mince pies to look forward to. A source told The Sun that Courtney is a pro who won't be intimidated by any of the big personalities in there and she won't back down from a row. Which is great because drama is really all we live for on that show. Courtney appeared on season 6 of RuPaul and more recently in MTV's Single AF where she had a few dates, but alas, didn't find long-term love. Who knows, maybe Celebrity Big Brother is her chance. That's all from me. See you next week when you'll be a whole one week closer to Christmas. Doing well, guys. Doing well.